Let's take a look at adding and subtracting fractions on a TI-30XS multi-view. And uh, the problem we're going to be looking at is one-half plus one-third. Now we're only going to look at addition, but subtraction is exactly the same um, method. So um, first off, we got a button here that says N over D, so let's push that. And then I can put in one, and then down arrow, put two, and right arrow, and then I'll put my plus, because we're going to add the fractions. If we're going to subtract them, we just do the minus. Then we do n over d, and then I'll do 1, down arrow, 3, and enter. And that gives you your 5, 6. Now, um, I'm going to show you another way to do this. Instead of doing the n over d, let's just uh, type in 1 divided by 2 plus 1 divided by 3 and press enter. Now we get a decimal to change any decimal to fraction. We're going to access the FD here. This is above your table. So you do second table and then you press enter and that gives you your 5, 6. Well, let's pretend we have something a little bit more complex than that. Um, so I'm going to um, start a new problem and press clear. And I'll do the N over D and let's do 20 over 30, right arrow, plus, um, I don't know, 80, oh, um, got to my fraction, so N over D, and then I'll do 80, down arrow to 100. Then right arrow, and press enter. Now, not only does it add to fractions together, but it also does the simplifying for you. That first one really didn't show it very well, because uh, after we got a common denominator on the first uh, problem, there was no simplifying to do after you added them together. But this one, if I did get a common denominator, which would be uh, 300, I believe, then what we'd find is we have to do some simplifying at the end. Well, um, now let's do 20 divided by 30. I'm going to type it in in this form instead of fraction form. Plus 80 divided by 100. And press enter. Okay, we get uh, decimal. To again, go from decimal to fraction, we'll do second table. That accesses your FD. And then press enter. And you see we get the same thing, 22 over 15. So that's how you add or subtract fractions. Fra subtracting is no different, just put a minus between them.